Hey, good morning. I'm Tim Archer, and we are reading through the Bible. Uh, we are in Jeremiah chapters 9 through 11 today. I've got the readings at timothyarcher.com. Jeremiah 7, we were reading yesterday, and he talks about how God's people were trying to make um, the temple a cave of robbers, a, a place where you know, robbers go to hide and, and be safe. And, and the idea that these people were doing horrible things and then trying to go to the temple and worship God and, and somehow be safe. Uh, it's the idea that religious acts don't compensate for a life that ignores God. Um, then chapter 9, you see Jeremiah crying. Uh, he's, he's called the crying prophet. And here he's crying for his people's sin. And he's crying for the punishment that's coming on his people because of the lives they're living. Because of the way that they thought that just because they had the temple, they were going to be safe. Just because they were doing certain religious acts, they were going to be safe. And, and Jeremiah says, no. You know, you, you can't live lives of, of lying and immorality and, and then expect God to be happy just because you do a religious act. So, what's for us? Well, we do the religious acts, we do the things that God wants, but we also give Him our lives and we live lives that reflect that religion that we profess to believe. And then we help others. We, we seek to help them escape their sin, seek to help them escape the punishment that's coming. Let's pray. Father God, we want to be yours. We want to be holy like you are holy. We, we pray that you will help us to imitate you, to seek you, and to be more like you. May we help others to know about you and escape the coming punishment. We pray this in the name of Jesus. Hope you have a great Monday.